you guys feel so far away from me. I feel like I'm going to have to shout so you can hear me. So, um, if I'm shouting and it sounds like I'm shouting, sorry. Hi guys, welcome back. So, today is a little bit different. First of all, welcome to April Madness. <laughs> um, so, for April, Monday to Friday, there will be a video. Every week in April, Monday to Friday, a video every day. I don't know why I'm doing this to myself, but I thought it would be fun and I could try like a few different things. It might push me out of my comfort zone a little bit. So that's what I'm doing. Secondly, this is a style video, which I have not done before. So I'm a little bit nervous, but I'm also quite excited because it's spring, it's sunny outside, I'm feeling spring-like, and a lot of these pieces make me very, very happy. So yes, we are gonna be talking about today some key additions I have brought to add into my spring capsule wardrobe this year. So it's just a few pieces that I've purchased over the last couple sort of six weeks, I would say. Um, there are only about six pieces in total, six or seven pieces. Um, and then just like a couple of little things I'm gonna talk about as well. So I'll talk about the pieces. I will link everything below in the description box if you are interested and it is all still available. Um, and I'm also gonna show you how I would style a couple of these bits as well. So if you like this style of video, if you like this style kind of videos make sure you give this a big thumbs up I'm gonna try and do these on the Mondays of every week in April um, so yeah make sure you give a big thumbs up so I know you like it um, I'm sorry if you don't don't forget to hit that subscribe button because at the end of April I will be doing a giveaway and yeah let's talk about some clothes so said clothes are behind me so I'm gonna talk about each piece why I bought it why I think it's such a great um, piece for spring in terms of like within a capsule wardrobe and then I'll do like cutaways on how I've like styled it as well so okay so the first thing just because it was at the front um, I'm aware this needs a good eye and I've literally just plucked this out of my wash basket because I was like I need to do this video um, this is just like a plainish blush kind of t-shirt with a little slogan on it I am really feeling slogan tees right now. I was at like autumn, like end of summer autumn last year. I just like having tees that I can just tuck into like high waist jeans or like a midi skirt that's got a bit of a higher waist, something that's a little bit different, but I am really liking having little slogans and things. I do have my eye on a Stranger Things t-shirt because we've just binged the first season and we're obsessed. So I do have my eye on that as well. But I just feel like slogan tees are such a versatile piece you can wear them with jeans you can wear them with shorts in the summer you can wear them with like a leather skirt for example a denim skirt you can wear them with a midi skirt you can wear them with so much you can wear it underneath like a pinafore dress um, and this one in particular I love because I love the blush tone and I really felt like it could go with any of like my coloured jeans um, it would go with quite a lot it's very kind of neutral I'm really liking this kind of blush tone at the moment that seems to be going around and also I thought it would go very nicely with these pieces this this piece here this 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 piece here that I'll be talking about in a moment and I really like this this was just from Topshop they do a lot of tees with like lots of slogans and things that fits nice it's a little bit oversized which I like it's just a little bit more comfortable a little bit more airy um, and yeah I like this a lot and because I did point to them, we'll talk about these next, so again, I did iron these, but like for the first time and they don't want to go like straight. This is like a little bit of a more dangerous purchase for me. I don't think I have worn white jeans since I was in my teens, and that was when I was like super, super skinny. But I just feel like white jeans are such a great staple for spring, and ever since I've bought these, I've been wearing them so much. They've been my go-to jean. These ones are really nice. They're the straight. They're a straight leg. They are the straight leg style from Topshop. I love that at the bottom they have like these frayed kind of edges, which just makes it a little bit edgy. They're not quite full length. They come up maybe like a couple of inches above the ankle, which I also really like. Makes them a lot more wearable for spring when it gets a little bit warmer. Kind of looks like it's a little bit more of like a warmer weather kind of style you know if it's a little bit higher um i also really love the fit of these they're a little bit high waist which i love i love that they've got belt loops so i can just put my like uh, leopard print belt through this um which looks really cool with this by the way and these are super super comfy i just feel like having a pair of white jeans is ideal for spring because it just lightens and lifts any look that you're doing you can wear a crop top with this not that I have any crop tops but you can wear a crop top with this you could just tuck something in you can wear it with this shirt you can style it up style it down I am gonna be doing a whole video where I show you three ways to style white jeans because that was requested by you guys over on my Instagram stories so that will be coming next week I believe and um, so I'm not gonna go on too much about how to style these because there will be a whole video on that but I am obsessed with these and I know 
they can be a little bit scary. I am petrified. That's wind, by the way, believe it or not. I am kind of petrified whenever I wear the, or it was the first few times. So one of the first times I wore this, I ended up having coffee. I always have coffee, but I had like coffee and then I had like lasagna in the evening with like red wine and stuff and I was literally there like, oh, I've got to spill something on here, this is not good. But I haven't, they've stayed pretty clean so far. But I really, really like these and I would highly recommend trying a few different white jeans. Find the style that's right for you. I personally love like the straight leg version that's a little bit more of like an ankle swing or I just think it's a little bit more versatile for spring. And I just think this is the perfect addition to any spring wardrobe because it's just so easy to wear, so easy to style up, and yeah, I love it. Look. Okay, so we're styling a few different elements here in one. So first up, we do have the pink t-shirt that obviously needs an iron here. Um, this just tucks in really nicely to a pair of like high-waisted jeans. I love the fit of this. It's not super like fitted. It's nice and kind of um, baggy, but not too baggy. It's just very comfortable. It's very light. And I love that you have like this little slogan and I love this shade, especially with the white jeans. Um, so obviously I'm also wearing the white jeans. I love pairing these with more neutral tones like this blush pink right now. I thought I'd prefer it with like blacks and navies and things, but I think I prefer it with like these lighter tones. I just think it's a little bit more spring-like, it's a little bit more subtle and just kind of lifts the whole look. And you can see these fit really, really nicely. Um, they feel a touch tight because this is like... You know when you wash jeans and you get them out and they've just dried everything, it takes about half an hour to get back into them. That's how I'm feeling right now with these. But um, they fit really nicely. Usually I do like pop my leopard print belt through here when I wear these, um, but I don't know where it is. I think I left it at my mum's. Um, so that is how I would potentially wear these. And obviously I'm going to do a full video this time next week on like different ways to style these. So. Stay tuned for that because there will be more. Um, and yeah, this is this outfit. And then if I was going out, I would just throw on this um, kind of fleecy denim jacket from Topshop, which I got back in the autumn. If it's still available, I will link it all below. But yeah, there we go. And um, this just kind of adds a little bit more warmth. So um, I've kind of been wearing this outfit right now, just as it is, because it kind of keeps me warm enough. Um, but it also kind of makes it a little bit less girly like tones the pink down a little bit um, and adds a little bit more bagginess but I really like it I think this whole outfit is really really cute okay so next we have something that kind of encompasses two styles that I am loving for spring right now so it's this dress here this is just a smock t-shirt style dress from ASOS um it's so pretty I one of the things, I love smock dresses for spring anyway because I feel like they're a little bit looser, you can wear them with tights, you can have a jumper over the top, you can put like a baggy jumper or like a, not baggy jumper, a baggy jacket or a leather jacket. You can style this so many different ways. Um, I just love a smock dress, I just think they're so comfy, they're very very kind of flattering, they're very forgiving. Um, and also because this is more of a t-shirt material, this is going to be so airy and comfortable to wear in the warmer months. I also love that it's this yellow colour. I'm really feeling yellow right now. I'm drawn to so many different yellow tones and it's not a colour that I usually go for. But if they did this in like a t-shirt or a shirt, this would go perfectly with those white jeans. Like, that would be really cool. Um, and yeah, I just think yellow is, I think yellow is going to be a bit of a staple for spring. I've just seen so many things in yellow and you guys know I'm a big fan of In The Fro, so Victoria McGrath and she put on there as well. She was going on about how yellow is going to be the tone. So. This is kind of her fault, there's another kind of yellow um, item coming, <laughs> but um, I really, really like this. I just feel like it's going to be so versatile, I'm going to wear it so much. I feel like this is going to be great for holidays as well, so I'm going to the south of France in July, which is going to be really, really hot. Um, so I feel like this is going to be good if we're like going into like a village for the day or something like that, or going to, to like Monaco for the day, which I think we're going to be doing at some point, because it's just going to be airy and light and still super summery. Um, but I also feel like this will be good for like spring, like with a leather jacket, some black boots, and that's how I would style it right now. Um, and then I'm also going to Florida in September, and I just think this is going to be great for like a, a day at a theme park or something like that, because again, it's super easy, because it's t-shirt material, it will dry very easily if I go on a water ride, and I really like it. I like it a lot. Cool, and then here is the little yellow striped smock dress from ASOS. I wish this had pockets, that's my only kind of criticism with this. I kind of keep wanting to put my hands in pockets. Um, like you see, it fits so beautifully. It's just super, super cute and like really kind of versatile for spring. 
I love teaming this style of dress with like boots like this and just kind of this being the look I think it makes it like a little bit more edgy a little bit more a little bit less girly but also obviously because it is still it's spring so it's not super super warm I've realized I've been wearing worn shoes on like our new carpet Adam's gonna kill me um but yeah so this is just kind of really nice and then you can just kind of team it with a nice little leather jacket just to kind of keep cool as well and I just think this whole look kind of looks really cute together really really nice um or you can make it even more casual and just put on some like converse or some trainers with this um this with like my little like converse I think would look really cute and then the last kind of clothing item we have is this jumpsuit from Monsoon so it is navy um when I was showing this on insta stories I had so many people going no it's black and I'm like no it is navy I promise you it's navy um which is like one of my favorites look how like cool navy and yellow go together We'll come on to that um but yes this is a linen jumpsuit it's actually part of their beachwear range my mum had a similar it was i think it's the same style but a different pattern a couple of years ago when we went on a holiday and i loved the look of it and where i've lost a little bit more weight i feel like i can get away with something like this a little bit more now um but i am obsessed it fits really really nicely it kind of cinches in at the waist but not to the point where it's uncomfortable because it's linen it's very very light and airy and very easy to wear but I feel like this is also something that you can dress up, you can dress down, like put a bit of heels and like really nice makeup with this and this would be like a really nice evening look or throw on some Converse denim jacket or something and it's like a really nice daytime look um, with like a bit of a black belt here. I just feel like this is so versatile and I feel like jumpsuits in particular for like spring, maybe not like when we get to summer, but springtime in particular where it's getting a little bit warmer but there's still a little bit of a breeze or autumn jumpsuits are just super super handy this and midi dresses i think is what i'm going to be living in for like spring i have a few midi dresses um i haven't brought any new ones this year but um it's probably gonna happen at some point but yeah i feel like jumpsuits and midi dresses is basically what i'm gonna live in i just think this is such a good investment piece it is from monsoon so it's a little bit more expensive um but because this is more from like their beach where it's not as pricey as some other jumpsuits that they have and I always find that anything you get from Monsoon, it does last really well and it lasts a really long time. So they are investment pieces and they do, like, they stand the test of time. They're not like, oh, this is the trend right now, so we're just going to do this. It's kind of like long wear pieces, you know. It's not fast fashion. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, so I really like this. I think this is going to be a really, really good addition to my spring wardrobe. And again, for holidays and things, I feel like it will be very nice to travel in because it's linen and very comfortable. Um, evenings in like south of France I feel like this will be perfect it can be very very stylish and look like it's really stylish and again in Florida same thing or if we're like wandering around a park or something it's a little bit colder one day this will be perfect okay so here we have the jumpsuit so this is just like super casual with like the lovely kind of orange sliders you can see they go kind of really nicely together there's a bit of padding clash there's a bit of color clash it looks really nice and nice <laughs> nice I've still got the tags because they literally came through the door yesterday um and i've just teamed it with this belt which i believe was from new look i actually think this came with a dress from new look about five years ago um so i've just teamed it with that just to kind of like break the print up you'll notice it is a little bit tight around here right now but that's fine i'm about nine pound off of my weight loss target which i should hit within the next kind of month or so so we're fine um they will it will be fine and then just to kind of make it if I wanted to add something a little bit extra I've just got this like little white kafgan kimono type thing uh, this was from Nuna a couple of years ago as well um, I'll try and find something similar and link for you below and this just kind of makes it a little bit more even more casual adds another kind of layer to it I think that looks quite cute and nice um, and I've got like a white lace kimono as well that I think will look absolutely stunning with this during the spring I think it will look really cool okay so those are the clothing pieces I do also have two shoe wear pieces so these are the first ones and I haven't gotten a lot of wear out of these just yet because it's not quite warm enough but we're getting there we are getting there and I'm I was towing the line between like do I love these do I hate these I didn't know but I wore them too much around the house so I couldn't take them back and it turns out I love them which is good <laughs> these are just some slide on kind of leather sandals they've got like the snake print effect but in this gorgeous orange print I just feel like this is so different I love the fact that it's like a bright orange so it's going to go with so much these are really really comfortable as well they're very easy to wear and I feel like these will be perfect for just like most of spring to be honest 
Um, moving into summer as well, these would be great for summer and holidays and everything. I really, really like them. Um, these are just from Topshop, if I didn't say so already, and they do them in different colours as well, but I really liked um, this effect and this pattern. And in terms of like how I'd wear them, I think they would go, they go really nicely with these white jeans. Um, they also go with the jumpsuit because it's got that navy. Navy goes with like so many different colours. Um, but it goes really nicely with like the navy jumpsuit but I would also wear this with like normal jeans and just like a plain tee or um, yeah there's so many different ways that I would wear these and they're very comfortable and I love the colour and the print I love like bright oranges and yellows right now it's the bag that I wear everywhere now is bright orange and I got that back in like November so yes I love those and then I've just thrown on these orange slide-ons so you can see they're super super cute they go really nicely with the white jeans um, they also go quite nicely with like the pink as well. It's like a couple of different pops of colour and where this is kind of pale enough I think it works. And then last but not least we have these little sandals from New Look. I actually got these from ASOS but they are New Look sandals. They are this lovely kind of mustardy yellow colour. They've got some studs along here that just kind of toughen it up a little bit. And I love that they're a bit of a lower heeled sandal so they're going to be so much easier for things like holidays or like if you go down like the pub usually you end up kind of walking back and stuff like that it's just a little bit more wearable for spring or summer I feel um, and again these are so so comfy I love the yellow style and again these are going to go really nicely with this jumpsuit with the jeans obviously I wouldn't wear it with the yellow dress as well because that's going to be too much yellow but I feel like if you're wearing kind of a very monochrome or very neutral outfit these will go really nicely because they'll just add a really nice pop of colour they kind of add a little bit more formality to any kind of look that you are wearing and yeah they're just really really nice really comfortable they're really affordable and I really like them here it is with the yellow shoes so it's like again you see these fit I haven't done them up properly <laughs> but they fit kind of really nicely they go really well with this navy I just think the two colours together look so nice, they're so good. Please excuse the fact that I am white as a lily. I haven't tanned for a couple of weeks. Um, and these are super comfortable and I just think this whole look works really nicely for like a little bit of a casual evening, um, popping down to dinner or like just going to the pub. I think this look works. Okay, so that is it. Um, there's a couple of other things for like spring that I'm really, really enjoying at the moment. So, I mean, I've been loving my gold, um, jewellery anyway but I'm also really loving rose gold tones right now any kind of pinky blush tones for most things I'm really really enjoying I just feel like rose gold is really really nice for spring because it just picks up on that really lovely kind of rosy colour um, and just adds like some more depth to what you're wearing and like another kind of shade to play with it's really really pretty I really like it for spring um, and also hair accessories I know everybody is wearing hair accessories right now I'm not a huge hair accessory person but I recently picked up a clip from ASOS which is like a bamboo ring it's downstairs and I'm too lazy to get it but I'll put like a photo in now um, really really pretty and I've been wearing that a lot just to like hold up like half up half down hair and I will say as a thick hair long hair, lots of hair girl person, that clip actually works really well. Because usually the reason I don't wear hair stuff is because it doesn't hold my hair up, but that actually works really well, so. But yeah, that is everything. I hope you guys liked this style of video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and I will see you again tomorrow for another video. Bye.